Yeah, Griffin's personality type, I think, um, the short version of it is I think sometimes it molds well with changing, meaning like he's not a super analytical, super like, I want to think every single part of this through. He's more like, hold it like this, do this, done. And he's like, okay, I'll do it. Whereas someone who's a little bit more analytical sometimes in breaking it down uh, doesn't work as well. Sometimes it does. So Griffin's more of a do this step one, do this step two, and he just does it. And it works well for him. So I coach that accordingly. I try and give him as little information as humanly possible and just like make this move. And that works well for him. Huh. All right, cool. So all in all, you changed some nice stuff there. Yeah. You made some nice changes no, I'm, past I'm week, doing, dude. Like, I'm doing some of the weight distribution. Yeah, I think a lot of that looks better, dude. Here's where I need to clean up a little bit, though. Um, take your normal setup, and I'll show you what that looks like. That's good, though. That's very good in a short period of time. Quick learner. Okay. Oh, I love this song. Oh, boy. Down I you. Uh, are you sick? Can you go over there and take a picture of me with my chipping setup, please? Yes, sir. Okay, ready? All right, tell me when to go. Go ahead. Yep. Now, let's see if you can see what I want you to see. Come on over here. Okay, so watch, see yours. <laughs> That's funny, I got you looking at it. See yours here. Okay, and then look at mine. Now, do you notice how during my chipping setup, my hips and my shoulders are perfectly level? Yeah. Meaning there's no tilt. Uh -huh. So I'm not tilted this way or this way. Yeah. I'm perfectly level. Yeah. That's important. Now watch when I pull yours up. See how your left shoulder is higher than your right shoulder and so your I left. Hip, I just got to level you out a little okay. bit. Yeah. It's gonna. That's something that's gonna cause some contact things for us. So let me show you what that feel would be like. Come on over here. So our ball position is good. That's all cool. I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna level out your hips here. Like, so okay. bend your this knee a little more. Ready? Okay. Cool. Okay. But I'm gonna push your hip. Ready? Let me just move you around here a little bit. Okay. Stay right there. Yeah. Stay there. Don't move. So the more you, the more you push this hip forward, mm -hmm. the more it's gonna go up as yeah. you go, typically. Okay. And, then, and the more you push this forward, the more this is going to tilt this uh -huh. way. So if you feel like this is a little more there, yeah, then it'll be easier to get level. Okay. Hip not as far forward. Okay. Make sense? Yeah. Okay. Make a swing from there. In fact, actually, just stand there. Let me show you what that looks like. Pull this back just a smidge. Stay there. Stay there, stay there, stay there. Okay, relax. So it's better. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I just don't. I don't want uh, to. Play I can full swing time. my left foot a little bit more, right? A little bit. Not bad though. I think your setup stuff asked that. It looks awesome. So let's just clean that one piece up, and then we're gonna clean one little in swing thing up, and then we're good. Oh. Oh. Okay, well. Like that a little bit. All right. That's cool. Here, let me move you this way just a smidge get off the hill. Okay. Cool. Good. Good. I don't care. Here, just sw swing one from. Uh, good. Swing one from there first. And then get this over here. Okay. You know what I'm saying? A little bit. Just a little bit with the chest. Okay. Yeah. Ten. You got twenty in you? Push ups? Chester. That'll boy, that's perfect. That's good. Okay. 